Good morning everyone. Now I would like to discuss a problem on consistent system of linear equations. If the given system is it consistent or not, first we can check and if it is consistent to solve the linear equation system. Okay. First, how we can say that the system is a consistent system? First, the given linear system can be write in the matrix form. In the earth, the expression of the matrix form is Ax equal to B. That is Ax equal to B. Here, A is a coefficient matrix. X is a variable matrix. B is a column matrix. Okay. In this, next we can take the augmented matrix AB. Then this augmented matrix can be reduced into the echelon form. Find the rank of A and the rank of AB. If both ranks are equal, then the system is a consistent system. That is nothing but the system has a solution. When it has a solution, the system is a consistent. Okay. The solution is also depends on their variables. Actually, the system is a consistent means it is divided into two types of the solutions. So one is a unique solution. Another one is the infinitely many solutions. Unique solution means the rank of A and AB is equal then that is a consistent. If that rank is equal to the number of the unknowns then the system has a unique solution. If the rank is less than the number of unknowns then the system has infinitely many solutions. Where it is infinite means the parameters are involved in the solutions. Why? Because we can take the number of variables minus rank is equal to some, we are getting the some number, such number of the parameters are involved in that system. When we can take infinite values to that parameter, why? Because the parameter is belongs to real number set. The real number set has infinite values. So, we are giving infinite values to k number or parameter, then we are getting infinite solutions. So, in such cases, the system has classified into two types. One is unique means the exact x, y, z values, variable values are only single values. Then that is a unique solution. If the values are the x variables are involved in the parameters, then it has infinitely many solutions. Okay. Now, I am taking the linear equations, the linear equations can be expressed in in the matrix form. A is equal to B. Here, a is a coefficient matrix, then that is 1 minus 2, 2, 2 minus 1, minus 1, 3, 1, 1. X is a variable matrix, X, Y, Z, and B is a column matrix, right side elements, 1, 5, 1, 8. Okay, now we can take the augmented matrix. The augmented matrix. The combined of A and B. A, B is right as a last column of A. Then that is called as the augmented matrix. Now we can take augmented matrix AB is equal to 1 minus 2, 2, 2 minus 1, minus 1, 3, 1, 1. The last column is 5, 1, 8. Okay. Now, we are applying the row operations on AB augmented matrix and reduce to echelon form means first we can reduce the second row first element, third row first element is into 0. Okay. By using of row operation means R2 is R2 minus 2 R1, R3 is R3 minus 3 R1. Then Augmented matrix AB is
first row is as it is 1 minus 2, 2, 5. The second row is 2 minus 2, 2 minus 2 is 0, minus 1, minus into minus plus 4, minus 1 plus 4 is 3, minus 1, minus 4, that is minus 5, 1, minus 10, minus 9. And for the third row, elimination of 0, multiply with minus 3, 3 minus 3 is 0, 1, minus into minus plus 3 to the 6, 1 plus 6, 7, 1, minus 3 into 2, minus 6, 1 minus 6, minus 5, 8, 8 minus 5, 3 is a 15, this is equal to minus 7, okay? Now, <coughs> by using of row operation, the third row second element is reduced to 0. Then it is R3 into 7 or 3R3 3 3 minus 7R2. Seven then augmented matrix AB is first two rows are as usual 1 minus 2, 2, 5, 0, 3, minus 5, minus 9. It is multiplied with minus 7. This is multiplied with 3. 0. 7, 3 is a 21. Minus 21, it will be 0. 5, 3 is a minus 15. Minus into minus plus 35. This is equal to 20 plus 20. 5, 3 is a minus 21. Minus into minus plus. 7, 9 is a 63. Plus 63. It is equal to 2. 42. This is equal to 42. Again, once again, 7, 3 is a 21, minus 21 is 0. Minus 15, minus into minus plus 35, it is 20. 7, 3 is a minus 21, minus into minus plus 63. 7, 9 is a 63. 63 minus 21, it is 42. Okay? Next, we can write, this is a linear equations. Before of the, first we can say that, is it consistent or inconsistent. Here, row of A means elimination of the last column. We are eliminating the last column. How many number of non-zero rows are there? Three non-zero rows. Row of AB, including of last column. Then that is AB. Both are equal. Therefore, the system is a consistent system. It is a consistent system. Okay. Now we can take row of A equal to row of AB equal to 3. This is equal to number of unknowns. The unknowns are how many? X, Y, Z. 3 unknowns. If both are equal, so it has unique solution. It has unique solution. If it has a unique solution means first we expressed the augmented matrix AB into linear equations with the x, y, z variables. Okay? The first equation is x minus 2y plus 2z is equal to 5. Let it be first equation. 3y minus 5z equal to minus 9. It is the second equation. 20z equal to 42. It is the third equation. Okay. From the 3, z is equal to 42 by 20. Okay. 2 21s are 2 tens are. It's 21 by 10. Z is equal to 21 by 10. Z value write in equation 2. 
then 3y minus 5 into 21 by 10 equal to minus 9. 5 ones are 5 twos are. 3y equal to minus 9 plus 21 by 2. It is equal to 9 twos are minus 18 plus 21 by 2. This is 3 by 2. So y equal to 3 by 2 into 1 by 3. 3 ones are 3 ones are get cancelled. y equal to 1 by 2. Okay. Next, y value, y and z values, write in equation 1. So, x equal to 5 plus 2y minus 2z. It is equal to 5 plus 2 into y is 1 by 2 minus 2 into z is 21 by 10. 2 1s are 2 1s are 2 1s are 2 5s are. So it is 5 plus 1 minus 21 by 5. 6 minus 21 by 5. 6 5s are. 30 minus 21 by 5, x equal to 9 by 5. Okay? Now we can check, is it correct or not? The solution is correct or not? x minus 2y plus 2z equal to 5. Applying the x value, 9 by 5 minus 2 into y is 1 by 2. 2 into z is 21 by 5. 10. 2 1s are 2 5s are. 2 1s are 2 1s are. Taking LCM, 5 is the LCM. 9 minus 5 plus 21 is equal to 30. 30 minus 5 by 5. 25 by 5. It is equal to 5. Therefore, LHS x minus 2y plus 2z is equal to 5. Then it satisfies the equation. Therefore, our solution is a correct solution in the, it is unique. Unique means the values are only one values. Therefore, the solution of given system is capital X equal to X y z x is the 9 by 5 y equal to 1 by 2 z is equal to 21 by 10 ok it is a solution how we can find out this consistent means first we can write the augmented matrix a b from the expression of the matrix form a x equal to b ok now next Reduced into echelon form, write in the first find out the rank of A and AB and which is equal to number of unknowns or not. If it is equal to number of unknowns, it is consistent and it has unique solution. Unique means we are getting the one values. That is, first write the what is the augmented matrix AB can be write in the linear form. From this, we can find out the values of variables Z, Y and X and once again you check those values are satisfies any one of the equation we are getting the correct e values. So that is the solution of the given system of linear equations. Okay. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel and share to your friends.